Okay, so welcome back to another Theme Park Eye Productions vlog here on the Theme Park Eye Productions channel. We're back, channel, excuse me. We're back at Bush Gardens and we're here for the Hall of Scream event. We're gonna have an awesome time. I already got the wristband, you know, in the park already. It's a Friday, so I don't think it's gonna be too busy. It's certainly less busy than it was on last Saturday. But yeah, we're gonna ride some stuff. Of course, Iron Gwazi's greeting us. Just look at that thing. Doesn't that look insane? Spring needs to hit just so we can all ride that thing. Ah, oh, it looks so good. It looks godly. Like, ah. Oh. Yeah, that thing needs to open up. It looks incredible. Hey, we're gonna go over towards like the Chile Hunt area in Montu first. Get those rides over the way. I wonder what the line for Chile Hunt is because as you can tell, not super busy. Not like what it was uh, on Saturday. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm excited to get on some rides again. Also, one of my friends is working. I, I don't know if we're gonna meet her but today, but we might, who knows. I'm Sophie, but you guys have seen her before. But um, yeah, so, so yeah, I think over here we've got crocodiles. Just thinking about it, but of course we're gonna be riding that crocodile pretty soon on Gwazi. Yeah. It's gonna, be, it's gonna be exciting when that thing opens. But yeah, I'll let you guys know what we're doing first when we figure that out. All right, so, someone, ex oh, Cheetah, it's only 30 minutes, what? Only 30 for Cheetah? Since when is this a thing? It's fantastic. Only 30 minute wait for Cheetah Hunt. That is not bad at all. First is the 100, like 20 minute wait that we saw last time. Perfect. Now that was the first. This lives right on. This is awesome. This is a great coaster. I mean, you can tell the theming is like very elaborate. I mean, that is awesome. That is super cool. So I'm excited to get on this. I think we might do Montu or Cobra's Curse after this. I don't know. It's it's kind of empty at Bush Gardens. I like it. Although I think they did stop the line for cleaning right now, so. Yeah. Yeah, they were just cleaning up the trains. I think they're only running one station. Oh, they're running both. No, they're just running one station. That's not bad. Time for this one. It's gonna be a great. Uh, we have a great time. Oh, yeah. This is quite a miracle. We got the front row. What? We got the front row in Cheetah Line. This has been a long time since the last time we rode Cheetah in the front row. This is exciting. It's gonna be a great ride. Have a good time. All right, so we got first ride of the day done on Cheetah Hunt. Great way to start the day. Got front row too. Like that was a miracle. Like it's been so long since I've done the front row just because it's been so busy at Cheetah Hunt. So we're either gonna ride Monster or Cobra's Curse next. See, look at that. We got front row in that. That was awesome. It's been so long since I last rode the front row. Yeah, Cheetah Hunt, fantastic coaster. See, I know, I still, I think I'm for Haggard's now, although Cheetah Hunt is a strong second when it comes to family coasters. So I think we're either doing Montu or Cobra's Curse next. So yeah, let's do it. And here's one of the scare zones here. Or it's just a social distancing sign, I don't know. Yeah, this is gonna be exciting. Definitely, definitely have to get on that later today. Second round of the day, Cobra's Curse, baby. Let's do it. Let's go get summoned by the Cobra's Curse on the greatest spinning coaster of all time. Getting the ones with the two longest lines. Go out of the way first, then hopefully the others should be too long. This ride's awesome. I love you some Cobra's Curse. Or oh, I do like this Cobra's Curse. Yeah, look at this. No way for quick two. Perfect. So happy to go on Friday, barely any lines. Unlike last time I was here when it was packed. <laughs> All right, so we rode Cobra's Curse. That was awesome. So we're gonna check out Montu and see what's going on with that. On the greatest inverted coaster of all time. This ride is amazing. It looks like it might be down, but hopefully it opens up pretty soon. It's a B&M, so you know, they're very reliable. All right, so Montu is down right now, but they might be uh, fixing it pretty soon. So yeah, B&Ms are reliable, so perfect. I love this coaster, this thing's so good. 
So just rode Mon 2 in the back row, or row 7, but still kind of closer towards the back. My gosh, that thing is just so intense. Like, oh, that ride is insane. Like, I love Monto. Like, that is a good inverted coaster. Best inverted coaster out there by far. Oh yeah, that that afterburn, like, but Monto is better. Monto is the best invert, definitely. Like that was that ride is insane. Like, let's look forward to Kumba later. Like. Like, I, I know a lot of people think Montu is the best right now, Bush Grind Tampa, before Iron Gwazi up in. Me, I still prefer Kumba, but Montu is up there. Like, that ride's so good. So, I'll let you guys know what we do next when we figure that out. Here's the elephant and the old school Rhino Rally. I remember this area back when it was Rhino Rally. Yeah. Classic. Classic VGT right here. Welcome to the wonderful land of Pantopia. With a gigantic drop tower right there. Oh, that ride is insane. It's gonna be a great time. This scorpion sand serpent, and we got some Kumba after this. Kumba daddy. That's right. Just get on this, have a good time. It's about to go down already. It's just dropping in the hollow stream. Falcon Fury is next on the table. We are going to have a great time riding this. This ride is absolutely insane. I got a house legal. This thing is crazy good okay so just rode falcon's fury how is that legal that ride is insane and scorpion has no weight so we're gonna ride scorpion the classic old school scorpion so yeah which is weird because typically this thing has a line because it runs with one train ox so yeah yeah let's go ride this thing the classic all right so we just did scorpion with that drunk man helix that thing is crazy for its age it is a just a crazy ride we're gonna ride up the good old sand serpent next or the bug out that's right sand serpent i wonder how uh, that's gonna be but down in this runs it's gonna be crazy that, that thing's gonna be nuts so yeah let's do it so sand serpent has no line this is amazing Literally not a single person here. This is how, this is what I like seeing when I'm at Miss Garden. No lines the for the old serpent. school bug out. Okay, so we did the sand serpent. His phone fell off the ride. And he hit the beam. Yeah. I hit the beam with my fingers. <laughs> yeah, his phone fell off and it landed on my butt, which is super funny. But yeah, sand serpent, that ride is wild. So yeah, next up we're gonna go ride Kumba. My friend's working there right now, so we may see her, possibly. So I get to ride the best coaster in Florida, Kumba Daddy. Let's do this. Yo, we got the front row again. What? This is amazing. All right, so we just rode Kumba in the front row. That ride is so good. It's been a long time since I've done the front row, since I typically ride the back row on this thing, but that ride is elite. Like that is an elite roller coaster. What happens if you turn Florida's best coaster in my opinion. So, real quick, we we're about to go check out our photos. Well, it's not just any ordinary person who's gonna be showing up photos. It's the one and only Sophie from Theme Parks Lover. That's right. And then look at right here. Just have my hands up. Awesome. All right, so we walked through a scare zone, but I didn't film it because you now it's not active. I don't want to spoil it for when we go through it later. Got 20 minutes until the event starts. Pretty much almost got through every ride before the event started. Pretty awesome. Yeah, we're gonna go ride Tigris next. The premier Skyrocket 2. And now this one runs a one train up. But we're gonna have a good time. And afterwards, ride uh, Sikra. But Sikra's awesome as well. And we got Tigris in the front. What? Crazy. Congratulations, you've conquered Tigris. This is awesome. We got the front row on Tigris, Kumba, and Cheetah Hunt. It's amazing. Okay, so we just did Tigris in the front. That was something. Like, you get lightning rod airtime in the front. Like, when you go up, you get so much airtime. It's insane. So, we're going to ride uh, Sheikra next. And we're literally 12 minutes before the event starts, so I think we tired the whole park before the event even started. Like, this is amazing. Like, we're getting through everything so quickly. Because there's, like, barely any weights. 
So yeah, let's go ride Sheikra. Have a great time. We've got the best seat in the house. Back row, Sheikra. Best seat right here. The back row. Way to go on Sheikra. Okay, so we rode Sheikra. That was awesome. But you know what's even more awesome? It's seven o'clock. So we rode every ride at Bush Gardens before the event started in two hours. That was awesome. Oh, great way to start off riding everything. It feels like Halloween Horror Nights. No way. It literally feels like Halloween Horror Nights. That is fantastic. <laughs> okay, I'll stop the cringy dancing, but yeah, we got everything before the event started. Fantastic. All right, so our first scare zone, oh, we're going through the sky ride. Whoa, we're going through the sky ride. The scare zone. First scare zone of the night. The shortcut. Take a shortcut to get some food. But we're going through the scare zone. All right, scare zone one, the shortcut. Saw a giant grim reaper right there, whoa. <laughs> kind of like a little uh, scare zone. I feel like one of these people are gonna move. Yeah, that person's gonna move. I just think. Whoa! <laughs> that was awesome. That was awesome. Look at that. Whoa! Oh, they got the pecs. They got. Whoa! <laughs> That is awesome. Whoa! <laughs> this is awesome. Oh, what the? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Get all the scares. <laughs> what? What? That was awesome. All right. Okay. That was a good little scare zone. Okay, so I finally got the chicken tender tower that everyone keeps hyping up about. Mm. That was good, but I better hurry up. Copyright music. Alright, so we might go check out the Fiends show next. It's like a little show that they're doing. It's over towards the Iron Gwazi Pavilion. So check that out next. I bet I think the coaster's got a bunch of wait times. So yeah, try to get some time for them. It's you know, it's in complete darkness. Oh, that would be a fun night ride. You know, in the daytime is fun, but like a night ride, you know, it's godly. I love you know, at night. He's going through right there. There it, is. Oh, there it goes. Oh, it looks like it's oh, it looks like it's hauling. No way. Oh, they got lights on Iron Gwazi. First time seeing that in person. The lights looks fantastic. Like other than like the station area, first time seeing Iron Gwazi. The lights like going through the track. That is awesome. Like you know, I I was here in February. I don't remember the uh, the lights like on like through the track I, I remember it all being on like the lift on stuff so, or through like the uh you're on the lift on in the station but not the rest of the course huh yeah that thing does look insane definitely want to ride it in the future so good and they got a little scare zone over here is it deadly toys scare zone two deadly toys all right, so Deadly Toys, it, it's like a chainsaw scare zone, so you know it's gonna be good. If it's chainsaws, you know it's gonna be good. Although, nothing's going on really. Oh, wow, that was good. What? This looks like Five Nights at Freddy's, what? What? Yo, this looks like Five Nights at Freddy's. What is going on here? This is crazy. Look at that. Whoa! <laughs> That's awesome. 
That is awesome. None of them are like coming at me though. Let's get through it a couple of times. I think it can, it can smell the chainsaw. Like you can smell it. it smells like the go kart of Fun Spot. Whoa! Dude, those are awesome. I love a good chainsaw scare. Like they're very aggressive. On teddy bear, like chase after the other big chainsaw. So yeah, I like. That's a pretty cool scare zone. I wish one of them came after me though. I need a good jump scare. I wonder if this is a little scare zone right here. There you got, oh, that's a giant, what? That's a giant skeleton. I did not see any videos or anything about this event before coming. This is amazing. I love bush gardens at night. Always will, always have. Why am I getting Coco vibes? Like, I don't know why. All right, so our next scare zone is going to be Hell on Wheel, which is the one nearby Iron Gwazi. Some of the legs on Iron Gwazi too. Pretty awesome. Oh yeah. Hopefully this music's not copyright. This looks awesome. Oh, we got like actual bikes. That's awesome. This is awesome. There's no characters though, but there is Iron Gwazi, which does look fantastic. Although the sign's not lit up on Iron Gwazi. So, although the wait time's kind of lit up, the line looks fantastic over there. We got these gigantic, colossal, big characters right here. Whoa! Look at these gigantic characters. Oh, and they got chainsaws too, and zombies. That's awesome. Yeah, people are scared, but I'm just like, whoa. Although, oh yes, look at that. That looks fantastic. Yo, Iron Gwazi is looking so pretty right here. They just got to open up the coaster. We coaster nerds are done suffering without Iron Gwazi for a whole year. But we'll get on it, so don't worry. We'll get on it one day. We're gonna like it. All right, so we gotta watch Fiends next, which is apparently their version of Go and Fed. Ever hurry up because it might be copyright. All right, so we just saw the Fiends show. I didn't record it because of copyright claim. I didn't want to make it too copyright, so I didn't record the show. But it was awesome. I did post some clips on my Instagram story, so you guys can still check that out. But my gosh, that show was funny. That was a funny show. Like. Is how they're talking about like the whole 2020 year like, with quarantine and then like pop culture. It was awesome. It gives me Bill and Ted vibes from Halloween Horror Nights. Yeah, I mean, it, was, it was an awesome show. So I think we're gonna ride some more rides next. I think it might be Secret pretty soon. The Secret is awesome. And of course, got spectacular views of Iron Gwazi. Just that thing needs to open. Like, really, it does need to open. So let you guys know what we do next. Maybe go through some more scare zones too. Don't forget about those. Uh, this is like a little creepy bayou style theme. I wonder if this is a scare zone. I know there's a scare zone around that area called the junkyard, which is where we're about to check out. And it got sodas there too and water and stuff. So need a bathroom. So there is a scare zone around this area. I do know. Or might already be in it actually. Cause there's this character right there. It might already be in the scare zone actually. This might be the junkyard. Ooh. Either the junkyard or a different scare zone. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> it does seem like they're like really getting aggressive though. I know over there they have like the junkyard scare zone, unless this is it. So yeah. And I got Iron Gwazi. Oh! Look at that. Wait, is it camouflage? That's awesome. It's like camouflage. That's pretty cool. There's no pink chickens over there. Sorry, damn familiar mayhem. No pink chickens, but they're definitely banging on stuff. You guys ain't gonna get me. I am a legend. Oh! Okay, that was good. 
That was a good scare right there. Even though it wasn't. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, that was good. I was not expecting that. It's what you least expect. Yeah, that was pretty good. It's camouflage, I'm telling you. This is a camouflage scare zone. Find our way through. Here, trees though. I think this might be the end of the scare zone. That was a little uh, surprising. I wasn't expecting that. That was dope. That was a good scare zone. All right, we're gonna walk through this scare zone again. I think it was um, tell something. Iron Glossy needs to be running though. Uh, that scare zone Iron Glossy is. Don't worry, we'll ride us that. Whoa! People are, oh, there's like flashlights. What? People were running. Jeez. Scare zone must have gone real. Oh yeah, let's go. These scare zone just got real or something like that. That was crazy. Wow. Also at the basketball game, this dude is making like some incredible shots. Draft him. Draft this man. He's awesome. He's an all pro. Draft him. Okay, I'm going to do the straight face challenge through this intense scare zone. In three, two, one, go. I conquered the straight face challenge. Let's go. Okay, so this is the junkyard. This is the whole junkyard schedule. I've never done, I've never seen this before. Whoa. <laughs> nice. So this is like a haunted house. Whoa. This is pretty cool. That's awesome. Look at that. Whoa! I wonder if this is like a legit haunted house, but outside. That's pretty cool. I can tell this is a Whoa! That is cool. What? It's like the disco yeti right there. Oh my god. That is awesome. That is awesome. Whoa! That looks like AC Adventure. Awesome. Oh god. No, he's doing nothing. Oh, the chainsaws are back. Yeah! Oh my god. <laughs> that was good. Wow. That was cool. I think this is the end. Oh. What? There's a swing. What? That's crazy. That was cool. Hold on. This might be a little nightmare. I was wrong about the last one. I guess this is a little nightmare. Yeah, this makes more sense. What was the last scare zone then? Just a regular scare zone? Wow. You 
guys don't scare me. I'm the most rebel person here. Nothing can scare me. Yeah, that's true. Chainsaws! Yeah! <laughs> no, I'm not one of those people who run from a chainsaw. That was awesome. All right, so we're gonna check out Sheikra now. B&M Dive Coaster. And this ride is awesome at night. This is a great night ride. Although, what do tigers at night? Because tigers night rides. Oh, it's so good. Can't wait till when Iron Gwazi's open at night. That would be awesome. Hopefully, Sheikra's not too busy. But this area is a little packed, so yeah. So Shikra has an hour long wait. We got time to come back to it though. We're gonna check out Tigers. That's a 65 minute wait. It's a little interesting. So we got a ton of return time. I think that's, that's the shortcut. We already did that one. Yeah, there's the line for the first scare zone we did. Yeah, we're gonna check out Tigers and see what's going on with that. All right, so Tiger says it ain't five minute wait, but the staff is so nice to let us on right away. So I want to thank the staff. You're awesome. They might do that. Check out one of the scares, the scares in Njogala after this, Mayrak Kumba. I have a feeling about around 11 o'clock, uh, like Cheetah Hunt, Coast Curse, Monty will all be empty. Maybe Monty will be running Shrimless. I like to ride Monty Shrimless. Pretty cool. Okay, so we just rode Tigress, and I think we broke it. Like, we were the last ones on, and all of a sudden it broke down. That's a little funny. The Tigress is awesome. I mean, a night ride on Tigress. Like, that was incredible. I feel like Tigress is much better at night than during the day. I mean, and we were in the back row, and, like, that drop in the back is absolutely insane. Like, it's an amazing ride. So I think we might check out um, Kumba next. Kumba then come back over and do Shikra. They also do have a scare zone over here. So yeah, we're out some stuff. All right, so this is another scare zone. Lycan Landing, I think the name of it. So I might get a little ride on uh, Kumba. Kumba Daddy, that's right. Whoa! This looks cool. Whoa! Yeah, look at that. How do you walk? Please take that. Okay. That's the end of the scare zone. That's a nice little scare zone. Not the best, but it's nice. Oh my gosh. Okay, so just for Kumba towards the back at night. That was crazy. Like, this is oh like why is this ride so good? Like, yeah, it's a little rough, but that's what makes it so good is the roughness. It, like, gives it that old school feel. And it, it was like, it was hauling, one, it was absolutely hauling. 
the mentors barely hit and like it was just so crazy the whole ride through like the whole the whole ride and the, like the pacing was just consistent well, i wonder if montu's like hauling as well we'll definitely go over to montu later park something for like 90 more minutes i think we're gonna go over and ride secret next we still got a couple more scare zones to do i know there's one in pantopia and one in egypt we haven't checked out yet so let's do those ones next Akumba, that was unbelievable. So good. Back in the scare zone. Whoa, that was cool. Nice. Oh, that was good. Wow. This is nothing. Don't scare me. I get nightmares from this. I think Tigers is back up and running again. So yeah, pretty cool stuff. But we're gonna go check out Shikra. Then I'll go back to Pantopia because there's still scarism that we have um, not done Pantopia and um, Egypt. So yeah. I like the lighting package of Tigers. Oh, wait, that's cool. They have like a whole lighting package. That's amazing. Uh, I didn't know Tigers had that. No way. So awesome. You learn something new every day. Let's go around Shikra. Shikra got busy quite fast. Look at that. It's a little crazy. But we're in quick here, so it's not going to be bad at all. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is a little cramped. I've dealt this before. Like last Saturday when I was here with David. Although, I don't know, we're going back up and doing that here. We went like 30 minutes. We're not that bad. Although, social distancing could be much better. Let's get a great view of Iron Guazi again. I think that's the Yo, we got the front row at Shikra. Let's go. We got the front row. All right, so let's go to Shikra at the front row. That was amazing. Like that tunnel dive, like you could not see anything. Like that was awesome. It was intense. It had been a while since I'd done it in the front. So it was awesome getting to ride in the front row again. Cause I typically like riding the back row on this. But speaker up, front row, slaps. It sucks. So yeah. So I think we're gonna walk over to toward Pantopia. Maybe get some water. Might just go to the water pond. And yeah, let's do that. Back in the shortcut. Whoa, it's the Grim Reaper again. Looks like Thogget Spirit might be down right now. Is it slowly going down? Sucks because I was wanting to go on this. The carousel open? What? Why is that open? Looks like Thogget Spirit is slowly going down, so I don't know what they're doing. Well, we might just go over to Cheeto Hunt, Monster. Oh, yeah, also we got Scare Zone to do. It's like a medieval style Scare Zone. So I'll definitely check that out. Uh, Maniac Midway, that's the name. Maniac Midway. <laughs> Looks like it's got crazy. Okay, oh, it's moved. Oh, that moves, nice. Ha, <laughs> that's awesome. This is all clowns, looks like. This is all clowns. Oh, I didn't realize I'm gonna have a freak show. That's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Oh! <laughs> That's awesome. That is awesome. Is anyone on Thogger Spirit? Oh no. Is this a scare actor? Or what's going on? Oh. Oh, wait, that, what? What? How did they do that? That's so crazy. This is on a whole nother level. Wow, this is fantastic. Good. 
good. You gotta enjoy these clown scare zone. Okay, this might be first. Staring contest with the clown. Go! Not blinking. Oh, he got me. Oh, good game, my friend. Uh, the clowns always win. All right, now it's very empty in the scare zone. We're going to go over to the area where Chill Hunt and Montu are and Cobra's Curse. Can't forget Cobra's Curse. But we definitely want to go on Montu one more time. It's Montu at night, hauls complete butt. Like, it really does. Hopefully the trim's off. Trimless Montu night rides, back row left seat. That is the way to go on Montu. And, and the fact how Kumbo is hauling tonight, I bet you a million bucks Montu's hauling. Like, I could just feel it from here. But have another run through in the Five Nights at Freddy's like scare zone, Deadly Toys. Deadly Toys! Deadly Toys! Yeah, that was cringe, but we are going through the Deadly Toys scare zone. So far, I've not seen any cars go through Cheetah Hunt, so I wonder if Cheetah Hunt's down or not. Hopefully not, because it'd be cool to do Cheetah Hunt. I think Monty's still running though, so yeah. Oh, Cheetah Hunt opens up. I have not seen it go in a long time. Cause that thing at night is fantastic. Like, especially right now, cause it's all pitch black. Like, it might be down. Hopefully we open it up later. But that'll be pretty cool. Right, Cheetah Hunt at night. There's still one more scare zone we have not checked out yet, and that's closer to where Montu is. You gotta check that out. Hopefully that area is like empty. Hopefully Cheetah Hunt opens up, because that'd be cool to ride Cheetah Hunt again. But I feel like it might be down for the rest of the night. I don't know. Hopefully not. If it is down, then no big deal. But there are people inside the station, so. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if this, that was a person or not inside the station. We've been cool again, she don't. People are saying that it's close, so it's probably down. Maybe it's a technical issue. Hopefully they get fixed. I mean, it's means are very unreliable, so yeah. Here's the panel scare zone that we have not checked out yet. The one close by Matu. I think that was all scare zone. There's a map right here. Oh, this was another scare zone right here. Diwazi Los Muertos. Apparently this one's new. We got a bus right here. The wheels on the bus go around and around. Okay, we'll stop now. First, 100 minutes. Ouch. <laughs> oh, Montu really looks like it's flying through. It's a, whoa! Oh my gosh, that was good. Whoa. I'm confused. What's going on? I think she's summoned. Oh, that is awesome. Wow. See, so yeah, let's go get a ride on Montu. The GOAT Inverse. Hopefully we can get around it, fingers crossed. People will get on Montu again, because it really does rock. All right, so we're gonna check out, see what's with Montu next. Hopefully we can get on. It'll be awesome to ride this thing again, because this ride is incredible. It really is an incredible ride. It's like an 80 minute wait or something like that, but we got to think so. Hopefully it's shorter for us. I don't think you guys can see right now, but we're on Montu. Um, 
I think they're just loading the new train, or they could be cleaning up the ride, I don't know. But we rode it about five. That thing is hauling. The trim is on and the mid course is on, but like, even then it is still hauling complete far. Like, why is that ride so good? I love Monto. It's awesome. Hopefully, two hunts up and running again. We might do that. Or maybe a coast coast, possibly. We'll see. Maybe five and three. Who knows? The, the park's only open for another like 15 minutes, so yeah. That's the tea right now. I think we're going to finish off the night with a night ride on the good old cheetah hunt. Classic. This ride's awesome. Well, it's not a classic, but it's a good ride. We are finishing off with what we started cheetah hunt. Need a breed for speed. Or the new breed of speed. Yeah, that's what that's what the slogan was when Cheetah first opened back in 2011. This one always has the longest wait at the park. Because it's freaking Cheetah Hunt. It's always gonna have a long line. Oh my gosh. Good Cheetah Hunt at night. That pro. That was hauling. Like that was seriously hauling. Why is she hunting so good? Like why? At night? It was awesome. So yeah. So I think it's now midnight, so the park's about closed. Park's closed. The park's closed now, so yeah. But yeah, that was a good time with Cheetah Hunt. So good. So I think we're about to head out now, unfortunately. Alright, so overall thoughts on Hall Scream. I thought it was a success. I absolutely thought it was a success this year. Fantastic event. Um, yeah, there are no houses, which I know Hall Scream does some pretty decent houses, but they are the kings of scare zones. Like, that's the thing, Holly. That's the thing that uh, they're good at scare zones. I'm looking for the rest of my party. They might still be inside the park, but I just left. I have no idea where the heck they are. So, while well, I'm just going to talk about it talk about um favorites so my favorite ride the whole day was um the, probably kumba or falcon's ferry that was good falcon's ferry um also love Montu. still like the favorite invert of all time um she at night that was awesome she goes great tigers was running well so yeah it was a, and a favorite scare zone of the night honestly i don't know there is a ton of good scare zones just like hard to predict one favorite so i'm gonna end the vlog here um thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you enjoyed it feel free to give it a like also don't forget to subscribe for more videos in the future also don't forget to check out theme park high productions on instagram for more updates and content i'll see you guys next time have a fantastic day